Zac Efron went to rehab twice. More and more details about Zac Efron's stint in rehab are continuing to emerge, and now TMZ reports that Zac did not go to rehab once, but twice this year. If you missed our first story about Zac's trip to rehab and struggle with cocaine, I posted the link below. Here's everything that you need to know about the updated information, though. Zac has reportedly been using cocaine for more than two years. He tried to clean himself up back in March by getting professional help at an outpatient facility for several weeks. However, when he returned to LA in April to shoot Neighbors, he relapsed. Like I told you the other day, he was not showing up to set on days that he was scheduled to shoot. So after the movie wrapped, he took a second trip to rehab. TMZ has also uncovered some details about why Zach's cocaine addiction possibly got so bad in the first place. Sources say there were four reasons. Number one, his issues with his parents who apparently are still a tad too controlling. Number two, he's upset with the way his movie career has gone since High School Musical. Number three, he apparently has a ton of quote, girl issues, who knew? And lastly, he's been hanging with a bad group of friends who actually introduced him to cocaine. On that note, he supposedly has nixed those fellas from his life. Now, HollywoodLife.com claims Zach has had a secret girlfriend for quite some time, and she's been very supportive of him and his struggles with drugs. No word on who this mystery lady is, but we will see what we can find out for you. And hey, the truth always comes out, does it not? Again, we here at Clever are wishing Zach the very best on his continued recovery, and we are so happy to hear that he took the steps he needed in order to get himself some help. Go ahead and leave your well wishes for Zach below and let me know what you think of this whole mystery girlfriend story. Is it true? Is it false? And who do you think she is? I want to know. Tell me below or tweet me and then make sure you subscribe and thumbs up this video if you're happy that Zach is back on the straight and narrow. In Hollywood, I'm your host Katie Krause and I will see you guys later. All right, you guys have been sending in the nicest, nicest tweets and comments about Zach. So first of all, hey Giselle, you wrote to us on Twitter. You said, at Clever News, at Zach Efron, still in shock. Good thing he's okay now. And because I love him, I'll replace the thought with his handsomeness and talent. Good thinking. And then over on YouTube, Critical Crash said, I was actually really proud that Zach was one of the few former Disney stars who didn't go to rehab slash get a DUI, etc. But it's okay, I still adore him and his work. I'm glad he's better now. Can't wait for his upcoming films. Me neither. And then lastly, Costin Lonet, what up Costin, said, I don't believe this. I don't understand what happened. Why? Hashtag clever news. And you know what? No one's perfect, but he's getting help. That's what I have to say about that. Don't forget, thumbs up this video and subscribe and comment. I'll see you later. Bye, guys.